Not that I don't look a plonker most of the time, but that is a 360 camera mounted on my BSA Bantam fuel tank is because I'm going to go to the filling station and get some fuel for mixing up for two-stroke. But yeah, as long as the selfie stick is in line with the body of the camera, it's actually invisible. And if you watch my videos closely, you'll see that where it breaks the width of the camera body on the knuckle of the ram mount, um, you can actually see the camera. But that is the challenge of riding and filming with a 360 degree camera. So not for the faint hearted, not for the busy roads and not for those roads that you're unfamiliar with, but hopefully you'll agree it gives tremendous results. That is the camera uh, 360 Insta X3 and the mount um, that I get when you appear to be almost first person perspective uh, following me from behind. Um, let's take a closer look at the mount. So I use a Manfrotto magic arm with a ball adapter into here. A short ram mount and then this is the insta 360 selfie stick with another ball round here so let's just show you what we're talking about with regards to cost this is about 50 pounds the ball that screws into it is about 20 pounds the arm is about 20 pounds this is another ball that's the same so another 20 pounds and the selfie stick is about 50 to 75 pound depending on the length please think about hitting the like button or better still hit the subscribe button thanks for watching ride safe everybody